In this video we are going to build a tripwire trap from an old water bottle. At first you need to mark the half of the bottle and then saw it apart. We won't need the lower part but you can save it for an upcoming project. Sand down the edges and put some duct tape on the edges. Now take a balloon and cut off the long part. Spread it out and tape it over the bottle. Of course you can use other flexible materials. Now take a little piece of wood, put some hot glue on it and glue a piece of thread to it. The piece of wood will push back the balloon. Insert the thread on both sides and push it through the bottleneck. And now you have a simple but powerful launcher. Now take both threads and tie a knot into it about a third from the bottom. You are now able to pull it back and put a piece of wood in between it and the knot holds it back. The launcher is now armed. In order to be able to push the launcher into the ground, you need to attach some sticks. Three of them should be enough. Take another piece of wood tie some thread to it and that's gonna make up your trigger wire. Attach a little piece of wood, that's gonna be the trigger. This is gonna be the trip wire. Pull back the launcher and insert the trigger pin. And if somebody stumbles across the trip wire, it will go off. Now let's test this outside. Simply pull back both threads this requires some force. Carefully insert the trigger pin and balance it on the edge so it's more effective. And voila, you're done. Find a good spot and stick it in the ground. Set up the trip wire. Add some baking soda, water, color, anything you want. And this is what it looks like when it goes off. In a paintball match you want to find a good spot and hide it with some leaves. Make sure to check out Grant Thompson's channel who inspired me to do this project. 